I'm Alex Trobe and I'm a cadet at your academy. Political science, poli sci is really great because it teaches you the way the world works. I mean, the way the U.S. works, the way other countries work, and I think that's so important to, to figure out and learn at this point. I had the opportunity to go to Washington, D.C. last summer, so I spent five weeks in Senator Scott Brown's office working as an intern there, and that was incredible. Just being in D.C. and being in the Senate, it really gave me a lot more faith in um, our elected officials and what they do. It was kind of a last minute decision for me. I didn't always know I was coming here. I was originally recruited for the swim team. I took a, a recruiting trip out here, fell in love with the team and the coaching staff, and um, it was really my chance to swim for an amazing team. I started looking at all the opportunities and what it really meant to be a cadet. It really appealed to my sense of um, just pushing your boundaries. It was one big blur. and. In processing day was actually pretty easy for me. I was in between two kids with Hawaiian shirts on. So they didn't pay attention to me, they paid attention to them. Well, I got all my stuff and I, I was in my room for in processing and my roommate, uh, Heather Nelson at the time, was Civil Air Patrol and had done all that stuff before. So I'm sitting there with this big bag of stuff I've never seen and her room, her side of the room is completely Sammy ready. It's She's asleep, she has her uniforms laid out, and I, I just sat there and cried and said, I, I don't know what to do. So it was a rough start, but we, we became really great friends. Uh, she helped me a lot, she carried me through, because I had no idea. Coming from a real strong swimming um, program in high school, I was, I was in real great shape when I showed up here. Great cardio, so the, the altitude didn't really get me that bad. But it was definitely adjustment to just learn about the military. The mental stuff, I could really, I could take care of it. It was just the knowledge of, they're taking me from a civilian to a cadet in, in roughly six weeks, and there's a lot to, to catch up on. The freshman year is just a really great sense of team. I had a really great freshman squadron. I was really close with my roommates and the girls on the swim team. Clearly, there, there's no way I could have ever known what I was getting myself into, but the people really, really helped me. Sometimes when I think about it, it's really humbling just the quality of people that are here, and you don't want to let them down. I mean, I'd do anything for them, so. When I was in my low spots and wanted to quit, they were there for me. I've never been more driven for one thing, I think, in my whole life. It was just make it. Make it to recognition. Life will be better. I think I see don't get enough credit here for trying to do all the right things. We're not just swimmers. We're not just cadets. We're not just scholars. We're, we do everything. Lucky for me, the swim team's been such a great group of role models. One of the girls on the team was a basic group commander. And that's really rare for an IC girl to, to step up for that role. It's very, very serious, very stressful, very training oriented. And she's able to be an IC, be an incredible leader and teammate on the team and also turn the switch and train freshmen for a purpose. I wasn't always the, the best swimmer. I got, I was cut when I was a sophomore. I worked real hard that summer, was training with the team, started traveling again, started swimming faster. And this senior year, I, I've never swam as fast as I have now. I think that swimming really helped me get through this place too, just in the right mindset in terms of, we work for hours. You stare at a little black line and the view never changes. You have to believe that the work that you're doing now is gonna pay off in a month, two months, the end of the season. You can't see it right away. But at the end of the day, you're, you have to hold yourself accountable to keep pushing, keep trying, keep testing those limits. Sometimes I feel like that's how the cadet wing is here. You know, you have four, four years and you can't see it on day one of basic or your freshman year or going through your junior year. Um, but you have to keep believing that it's, the process is changing you. I know now that I'm a much different person coming out of this institution than I was when I came in. It took me a long time to realize that that was happening to me and that if you stay focused, you focus on all the right things, try to learn how to become a better leader. Suddenly in four years you wake up and you throw your hat and you realize that you have become the person that you wanted to be. We had interviews today actually for the, the next semester's leadership and I'm just blown away by the kind of people that are here, and I don't think I'd make the cut. We forget sometimes that we're all incredible people. We're lumped in the same group, we're told to conform to this, this standard, but at the end of the day, I, I don't think we remember just how special we are here. It was, it was really humbling just sitting on those interview panels saying, someone thought this about me. 
that blew my mind, really. It hit home because any one of these people, I think, could change the wing, could change you know, their squadrons, could really make a difference. And I can't wait to see them next semester do it. This experience is something that I've never would have imagined. I came here thinking that I was going to leave in two years. I'll just try it out and see what I like and you know, maybe stay for four years. But I, I loved it. It's been a crazy wild ride, and day one, if I, had, if you had told me that I would be here, not only excelling within this system, but helping to to lead, be a leader within it, uh, I would have called you crazy because I, I didn't know anything. I'm just starting to realize how to, how to make everything work for me, and how to work within the system, and how to to lead within the system. But I know that, and I'm ready, ready, willing, able. Can't wait to get out there and and try something new. I'm Alex Trobe and I'm a cadet at your academy.